You are allowed to erase anything from existence, and you will be the only one that remembers it what do you get rid of? Mosquitoes. Mosquitoes are annoying, but I think I hate ticks even more. Both mosquitoes and ticks are rampant in my area during the summertime, and finding 8 plus ticks on me after a short walk to my camping site is really maddening. I can never truly be sure I've gotten them all off. I get it. I hate fleas way more than I hate mosquitoes. But mosquitoes kill more humans every year than any other animal, except humans of course. So I think we should still got with mosquitoes. Plus wouldn't it be fun to watch the world try to figure out why malaria suddenly just went away. That alone would make it worth it. WW1 but not WW2. Imagine the confusion. WW2 would be the Great War, and different reasons would be there for starting it. We I might not even happen considering that Germany wanted to conquer the world B slash C they lost and were completely bankrupt. They'd still be bankrupt, but world know why. AHH duck. Adolf got drunk and went on Amazon again. Corrupt politicians. It'd be interesting to see who doesn't disappear. It'll be like the end of Infinity War. Or look at you thinking only half of politicians are corrupt. There are a lot of politicians out there. I bet there are enough straight arrow politicians in local and regional governments to offset the more prominent corruption at national levels. Porn. Hey guys I have this great idea. What? That's such a strange concept that no one's ever heard of. It'll never take off. TV and radio are just a fad. Nobody will ever need more than 640k RAM. Child abuse. I would not want to be the only person who remembers child abuse. No therapist would know how to help me. It would be awful. I'd take one for the team. Better me remembering than anyone else knowing. Depression. Hash M-A-K-E-C-H-E-S-T-E-R-P-R-O-U-D. Yeah right. I did want to listen to LP all night. I just heard one more light today and lost it. Such talent. Gone too soon from this earth from something totally preventable. Bed bugs. The time I shit my pants in 5th grade. Yes this is where my brain went to. My most embarrassing moment. Not when you shit your pants. Look at these selfish moffas. All the shit in the world and they only care about the one that was in their pants when they were in grad school. Multi-wipe shits. One wipers from here on out. As someone who literally just dealt with this, I'm now voting you for president. Goddamn coronavirus. Coronavirus is be looking at each other like, do you want to erase all of us or just COVID-19? Other coronavirus is be like mate. I didn't do anything. Well there's also SARS and MERS. The common cold is a coronavirus as well from what I hear. That time I said you two after the waiter told me to enjoy my nachos. Alternatively, you still say it, but the waiter takes it as an invitation and the two of you enjoy nachos together. The awkwardness is still erased. And then they start dating. Perfect romantic comedy right there. Pedophiles. Let's say that, rather than vanishing people, what goes away is any attraction between an adult and a person say. 17 or younger. Like adults just aren't attracted to you until you hit a certain age. And that includes visual depictions of youths as well. Maybe before then only other young people are attracted. So people still date in high school. Can you imagine how the media landscape would change in, say, 3 years? We would stop seeing the hypersexualization of young actors. People would find even the suggestion distasteful and repellent as opposed to scandalous and intriguing. Musicians would stop preying on teenage groupies. Film and music producers would stop taking advantage of vulnerable young talent. Even having adults portraying hot 16 year olds wouldn't be a thing anymore. BC no one would find it appealing. The CW TV network would go into a tailspin BC if superpowered teenagers aren't hot anymore. What is their network even for? MTV and Freeform 2. People would be able to somewhat trust churches again. I say somewhat BC adult nuns get abused too. I hate to say this, but not all child abusers have pedophilia. Neurotypicals do it because it's breaking a huge taboo and is therefore a massive power trip. Your world would be an awful lot better though. Circles. 
They are pointless. Lol. I see what you did there. Stan's not existing in real life or cancer. Solve both problems with crazy diamond. Oh I Joseek I used my stand's a hand to erase cancer. I would get rid of the rule that genies don't exist and don't belong to me. This creating genies that belong to me. I would then do whatever the hell I want. This is too big brain for anyone to handle. Bose thank you. Thank you. COVID-19. Everyone wandering around wondering why the duck they have 500 rolls of toilet paper and no job. Life would return to normal. There wouldn't have been a panic. It never said it changed history. Just that it erased it from existence and no one remembered. So everyone would be wondering what happened and why they were at home. Alternatively, hospital beds would be full of completely well people confused as to why they were in the hospital. Right now. Coronavirus but keep the newfound respect for medical workers and retail workers. The stingray that killed Steve Iwin. Sorry man but he'd still be dead. If it was erased from existence then it would have never killed him. Right, if not, what would people think he died to? Anti-vaxxers. Cancer various other things like my autism and stuff. Autism is my choice too. Yeah I've learned to live with it im, not on the big part of the spectrum. Im really like aware of my surroundings, and are careful thanks for agreeing with me, d. Racism. Myself. If I could, I would do it in a heartbeat. I don't know, I forgot. But you would remember. Daylight savings time. Fried chicken. Then I invent it again. Cockroaches. Evil. People that abuse animals. Hate. Basin animal crossing. No. Wait it's at least a C plus. Hey, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.